Hello everybody. Welcome you all at Learning is Fun with Prabha Parunita. Today I am going to tell you about two words that are especially and specially. What is the difference between these two words is the main thing of today's video lesson. And before start, I am going to tell you or give you two sentences. And you just think about these sentences and try to find out whether there is some differences or not. So, the sentences are... It was not especially or specially cold. Can we say that? Or in another sense, when we say these shoes were specially made for me. So, do you find any difference or any differences between these sentences? Let's see. Of course, there is the differences. Here, especially and specially can often be used with the same meaning. This is a very common thing. We can often use these two adverbs for a same meaning. Here, the first example was, it was not, you can say, specially or especially cold. In this context or for this sentence, you can use both especially and specially. There is nothing different here. But another example, I just wish to tell you about the same meaning that is, I made it especially or specially for John. Here also the meaning is same and you can choose either of any of these adverbs. So the problem is that especially means mainly, mostly, chiefly, etc. And here uh, the example for you, I prefer especially Darjeeling tea. Here uh, the meaning is that when I'm talking about these sentences, this means I prefer mostly or mainly or chiefly the Darjeeling tea. But specially is used for a purpose. When we are talking about a purpose, we use specially instead of especially. Let's see the example here. This dress is made specially for hiking so here hiking is the purpose and the dress is made for hiking so here specially refers to a particular purpose now there is another important point while using this adverb especially in a sentence that is, when we are going to use this adverb in a sentence, especially always follows a subject. That means we have to use especially after subject. Now, let's see the example. Here, all my family like music. My father especially goes to many concerts as he can. Here in this example we find my father is a subject and we have to use especially after subject. That is after my father. And here uh, if we say especially my father goes to many concerts this is not the correct use because always we have to use especially after subject young babies especially are vulnerable to cold here we find young babies is the subject and especially is used after young babies now, there is another important point. 
we can also use especially in front of an adjective to emphasize a characteristic or quality let's see the example i found her laughing especially annoying here we find annoying is an adjective and here especially is used before that adjective uh, to add or to emphasize certain characteristic or quality now let's see about specially as i have told you earlier specially is always used for a particular purpose when we are talking about if there is any purpose or particular thing we are going to talk about we have to use specially and here are the example for you that is these shoes were specially made for me and here uh, specially refers to a particular purpose again the cake was specially made for the occasion that means uh, someone made this cake or the cake was made for uh, that occasion here uh, specially refers to a particular purpose or you can say that i bought this gift specially for you here also i'm going to tell you or i'm just talk about a purpose so hope you like this video lesson if you have any queries please do comment in the comment section no more today thank you for listening and bye bye